Hello ladies and gentlemen, my name is Roman, the True Football Fan, with you guys today once again. And we have some breaking news pretty much in the NFL. And right now, the word's going around that linebacker Daryl Washington of the Arizona Cardinals is being suspended the entire season. Now before I jump into the video, I'm a little sick. My throat's hurting me. I'm not feeling too well. I'm a little nasally probably, so I'm going to be drinking some water. Sorry, it's a little not super professional. I'm a little sick. Anyways, so Darrell Washington, probably the second biggest player on the Arizona Cardinals defense behind cornerback Patrick Peterson. Darrell Washington is pretty much a beast. The dude's a monster. He's super good on defense. He's really fast. He's really versatile. He's really strong. He knows the playbook. and He's just a great defensive player, and he fits very well in uh, on the Arizona Cardinals. Now, with Darrell Washington being suspended due to the substance abuse policy, now what I'm assuming is is it's probably marijuana once again. I'm not going to use the real term. I'm not going to use weed. He's probably been smoking some marijuana. So it's just, I don't, I'm not trying to blame Daryl Washington. Well, I am blaming Daryl Washington for uh, being suspended, but because he's a very good linebacker. I live in Arizona, so I get their games on TV. I want to see some good defensive effort. Um, and by now, NFL players should realize that you're going to get randomly drug tested if you smoke. I mean, so just don't smoke weed. If you're, if you're going to smoke it, smoke it in your off time. Don't smoke it when you're getting into OTAs and you're getting in a mini camp. You can't be doing that. So, I mean, with Josh Gordon recently, even he should have realized that, oh, Josh Gordon just got caught. I shouldn't do it. But he probably ended up doing it anyways. I'm not... It's, I'm not for sure if it's marijuana. It's just my assumption because that's what always comes down to be is this marijuana. And, I mean, it's sad. It's sad to see him not play the entire season. He's one of the reasons that Cardinals have a top five defense in the NFL. And I'm going to go right out and say it. A lot of people might disagree with me, but a lot of people will agree with me that the Arizona Cardinals have a top five defense. With Daryl Washington gone at the linebacker position, that's just a brutal blow to that defense. Now we've got Tyron Matthew who's coming into his second season. We don't know how he's going to play after being injured um, for the la second half of the last season. And then we have Patrick Peterson, who's just a monster. He, I mean, he should be doing fine. But losing a great linebacker like him, that's a big blow to that linebacking core. The Cardinals were, were not very good at stopping tight ends in the first place. And now to lose a linebacker like that, that's, that's a big blow. So, I mean, if you're going into fantasy football this season, if you're going for tight ends, pick one up every week that's playing against the Cardinals because you're going to get some points because that linebacking core is demolished. Now, I'm going to pull up here, actually, who the Cardinals drafted. <coughs> excuse me. Uh, first round in the draft. And uh, excuse me for having this not prepared. But uh, um, Arizona Cardinals, 2014 NFL. Draft round one. Um, they drafted. Duh, 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 duh. Hang on one second. Dion Buchanan. Now they drafted a safety. Um, which, which was the need for the team? They needed a safety. Um, because we weren't really sure how Tyron Matthew was gonna play. Dion Buchanan is a beast. He's really good. He's a very good player, and it was a good draft pick. But now, I mean, yeah, they drafted players later in the draft to address other issues, but I didn't think they expect Darrell Washington to be suspended the entire season. Now, could I think the Cardinals could have made the playoffs this season with help like that? But with him in, with him gone the entire season, I don't know. That defense is a top five defense, and without him, I don't know where they rank. They probably rank maybe top ten now, top fifteen ish. It's just, it's a brutal blow to that defense and where are the Cardinals going to go from here they're probably going to pick up a free agent they probably might trade um I don't know what they're going to do I mean yeah they have some backups yeah they have some other good players it's not just Darrell Washington but Darrell Washington is I've been saying it over and over he is a key player on that defense and he's one of the reasons the defense gets pumped up and the reasons they succeed so much in defense the dude's a beast and he's a key cog to that defense and with him gone the entire season I don't know. It's just a big mistake by him. It hurts the Cardinals' playoff chances, I think. Just, it's disappointing. 
Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. What do you think about Daryl Washington? Tell me down in the comments below. Uh, tell me what you think about, you know, how the Cardinals are going to fare. Are they going to do fine without him? Are they going to do not fine without him? Are they going to make the playoffs without him? Are they not? Um, let me know down in the comments below. If you want to catch up on all things video games, movies, sports, NFL, NBA, MLB, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. It'd be greatly appreciated. I put a lot of time and effort into this. I'm going out of my way while being sick with my family still awake, which is rare. Surprisingly, they didn't interrupt me this time. So go ahead and like the video. If you completely hated the video, go ahead and hit that dislike button. That's your opinion. I'm not going to complain. But go ahead and as well share this video to get the word around about Daryl Washington and let people know that I am trying to make a difference within the YouTube community by putting a lot of time and effort to give videos to you guys to give you all the right information that you need. Thank you. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Have a great day.